All right, guys, I'm making this video actually looking for advice. Um, I know a lot of you guys out there who I've uh, become friends with are hunters. Um, and um, I've always wanted to get a compound buck. And uh, so I got the opportunity to grab this one yesterday off Craigslist uh, from a local person. And um, this is what I know about it. I was told it was a bear brand, B-E-A-R, um, brand bow. Uh, 80 pound pull and that is all I know about it and I have no idea what the hell I just said I know nothing about this this is something I'm going into like I went into the banjo totally and completely blind I know nothing at all so uh, there is no name he, he insisted it was a bear brand there's no name anywhere on this bow I've hunted everywhere so uh, trying to give you a close scan of it and maybe one of you guys are familiar with this tell me if it's a bear in fact or what brand it might be and or if it's a piece of crap or if it's um, something that uh, was a good investment. I'm just trying to pan from one side to the other. He also told me that the strings were very recently um, changed and uh, there are no fraying on the strings one thing I did look for. There's no fraying at all on the strings. The arrow grips there on the string is good. Um, I'm going to flip it over. Scan the other side of it for you. And uh, any advice at all you can give me. I know these are the adjustments is what you told me for the tension. things here which I didn't even ask him about that piece right there and the piece on top I'm assuming that that is for some type of removable um, sight scope of some sort or maybe a quill I don't know again uh, I know absolutely nothing here guys about this asking for your advice so um, tell me whether you think uh, I just threw away 40 bucks or I just got something worth messing with um, as a uh, novice, uh, just a beginner. Yeah, construction going on next door, sorry about the noise. But um, anyway, also came with these two arrows, one of which I know is a hunting arrow, it's got the points coming out of it, and the other one is just a target arrow. So um, I was shocked to see a one on eBay, as much as just the arrows are, but anyways, the two arrows and the bow, uh, I paid 40 bucks. 40 bucks. Um, the guy said he was just selling it because he bought a new bow, uh, and he told me when his bow was new, and this is the part that I believed was bullshit, but he told me when his bow was new, he paid over 300 bucks for it. So, um, you guys can tell me, uh, again, um, exactly what you see, what you think, and, uh, whether you think it's a piece of crap or not. I know the arrow guide here is worn. That's worn. I assume that's uh, easily replaceable. I don't know. But that's it, guys. Just uh, something I decided to get into here, just as a little hobby, something to do, something to, uh, you know, kill the winter time with when I'm not working on the tractors and stuff. So uh, tell me what you think, and um, appreciate all the advice you can give me. Thanks for watching. Welcome, Daniel.